What up, though? You already know how it goes. Smash, like, subscribe, comment. I don't care what you comment, as long as you comment. You dig? Yesterday, uh, the boy C, I can't pronounce his name. I call him C. Um, his link will be down in the bio. Uh, he a Detroit jitter. He invited me to um, the Hispanic Cultural Center on Trumbull. So it was a JIT Fest hosted by, uh, I believe it was Tech Troy. Shout out DJ Clint from Chicago, man. His mixes is so hard. He showed me what a real DJ was. But when I went down there anyway, oh, shout, and shout out to him too uh, for, for teaching his son, you know, how to get busy on the JIT thing. He, he real, real good, real talented. You can't mess with Detroit guys, but it is what it is. And and, and he got a son DJing too. So shout out DJ Corey. That's that's. And, and he repped the son the whole night. That's my son, y'all. That's my son, y'all. Proud father, man. That's a beautiful thing, man. But um, I go down there. I asked the lady, man, why, why they, where are they dancing at? She's like, well, inside the building. So I thought it was going to be a jig contest. But actually, it was a break dancing contest. And I've never seen break dancing in person. only seen it on the 80s-based movies. But just the cultural diversity that was in that building at the Hispanic Cultural Center, man, it was crazy. Asians, whites, blacks. Four-year-old little white kids out there break dancing. Uh, the B girls. It was it was hosted by Rock City, uh, Break Clothing Line, and B Girl City or something like that. Man, phenomenal show they put on. Um, just a beautiful event. People were so nice, man. That that's something I definitely go to again. I definitely got to see another break dancing contest. And the women, like I said, the women was just friendly. Like, oh, it was. All type of women. It was a woman down there, so beautiful, man. Two of them. Like, I couldn't even tell what they were. I didn't know if they were Somalian. I didn't know if they was Guatemalan. I didn't know what she was. Mixed, black, white. I don't know what she was. Beautiful. You know, let me, let me, let me, I'm going off the deep end with this woman. Come on. But after that was over, we went outside and in a parking lot, it's the Jit Fest. Crazy. And I'm like, why is there so many white people? Like, this many white people intrigued. You know, with the JIT culture, but it got a tech vibe to it, and I didn't, I didn't understand. I didn't see the correlation. It's, it's real techno, and with the JIT, the house music, man. So everybody vibed out there, as you're gonna see in the videos. Little white kid out there, jitting, trying, doing his best, man. Everybody was impressed with what he was doing. People out there going crazy on, on the rave dances, and it, it, it just felt like it was a no judgment type of zone out there, man. It was just everybody having fun. Uh, we, it was only uh, one drunk white guy getting a little too close to why the kid was dancing, spilling beer. But outside of that, it was no fights. It was no shootouts afterwards. A bunch of vendors out there making their money. I tried to spend a couple dollars with everybody that was out there, man. Because, you know, when you put that in the ethers, you, you get it back somewhere because you want somebody to support you. And they came out there to make money, too. That's why they hosted the event with the vendors out there. And then it was just culture. Man, it went down out there, man. The later it got, the more people came out. Beautiful, 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 beautiful thing, man. Go follow Tech Troy, T E C T R O I T. Yeah, Tech Troy, like you spell Detroit, but take the uh, D E out um, and, and put the T E C. Phenomenal event, man. Like, it, it was the, the style out there. You seen the, the girls with the big old pumps on, black women with the big pumps on, the gothic. Then you seen the preppy ones. Then you seen. The ones that dress urban, like the the whole, it was a whole bunch of people fresh out there. I seen Josh, uh, oh, shout Gabby, um, the jig queen. I should have took a picture with her, but I talked to her. Beautiful soul, and she beautiful. Oh my god, um, I seen seven the general while I was getting something to drink. It was just a good night overall, man. Check out the video. Make sure y'all smash like, comment, subscribe, share. Want more people to come out next time. Next time I I know I didn't know it was gonna be this good. Next time I'll put it on my page. Y'all really should have been out there, man. Like everything went right. The the, the 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 girl, you know, you seen out there going crazy doing the thing. I had to slide up on her. I just like damn, like what level you on? And, and and what was crazy about it? She wasn't even inebriated at all. Just a free free spirit, a little too free, but free. You know what I'm saying? That, that didn't sound right, but whatever, man. Vibes was great. Vibes was great, man. I'm very, very impressed at Tech Troy event. DJ Clint showed me what a real DJ was. He rocked the crowd. His mixes was great. Y'all Detroit guys got to step it up on the mix, and they can't mess with us on the footwork and the body, all that. They can't mess with us. And, and, and I, 
I didn't know he's an east west side type of thing with the jitting thing. West side guys do it fast. They rush through moves. The east side guys say West side guys say ours look better. It it's, it was crazy, but that's the type of competition you want to be around, man. Not talk about who got the, who, who wearing red, who wearing blue. You know what I'm saying? That's the type of competition I like. But um, we got to step it up on the, on the mixing. DJ Clint out there killing them, killing them. His mixes is crazy. We got to step it up, y'all. Peace.
with bass.